Welcome to live2clays.com, best e-learning portal for IIT JE, NEET and Foundation. Hello students, in this video I will discuss how to calculate mole fraction of a solute in a solution. This is the problem given and problem states that calculate the mole fraction of benzene in a solution containing 30% by mass. Here we got the mass of solute in carbon tetrachloride. It means that benzene is added to carbon tetrachloride to make a solution. And so here it says that 30% by mass means benzene is added by 30% by mass means it means that the mass of solute is 30 gram. Then the mass of carbon tetrachloride will be 100 minus 30 is equal to 70. This is the mass of carbon tetrachloride. 70 plus 30 gives us the mass of solution. Here we got the mass of uh, solute and solvents. Now we can apply mole fraction formula. Mole fraction formula is moles of solute upon moles of solute plus moles of solvent. In case if we have to calculate mole fraction of uh, uh, solvent then formula will be here we will put solvent moles of solvent and the rest will be same to calculate moles fraction we need to know the moles of solute and solvent that's why we convert mass of benzene and mass of carbon tetrachloride into moles here we have the mass of benzene 30 gram and so the we need the molar mass molar mass to convert mass into moles molar mass of benzene is 78.11 uh, gram per mole you can so find this value uh, find this value uh, by using periodic table of elements here we get one mole upon 78.11 and it is gram means one mole of benzene has 78.11 gram you can divide these values and say the value which we get here we get uh, the top we have 30 and it is divided by 78.11 and the value which we get that is 0 0.384 here we have 0 0.384 and it is moles of benzene benzene now next in similar manner we convert the mass of carbon tetrachloride that is a solvent into moles here we have 70 gram is the mass of solvent multiplied by the uh, molar mass of carbon tetrachloride uh, chloride is 153.82 gram per mole then one mole upon uh, 153.82 and it is in grams you can uh, directly divide the mass of a substance by its molar mass it will give the moles number of moles i'm just showing the setup so that uh, in a proper manner you can cancel the unit and uh, the final unit you get in moles now you can divide a 70 by 153.82 here we have 70 at the top and divided by 153.82 and the value which we get that is 0 0.455 here we have 0 0.455 and these are the moles of carbon tetrachloride now we can apply the formula for mole fraction a benzene that is solute it means that at the top we are going to use moles of solute now here we have mole fraction let me write mole and uh, fraction is equal to at the top moles of solute moles of solute that is benzene 0 0.384 upon moles of solute against uh, value we have 0 0.384 plus moles of solvent carbon tetrachloride is solvent in the solution here we have 0 0.455 we can add up the bottom values here we have at the top no sorry uh, 0 0.384 and we add 0 0.455 and the value which we get 0 0.838 here we have 0 0.838 384 at the bottom 0. 8 sorry 0 0.839 0 0.839 this is the value we get now we can divide these values and it will give us the mole fraction of benzene at the top we have 0 0.384 and divided by 0 0.839839 and the value which we get that is 0 0.45 uh, we can round up this figure 0 0.458 0. 458 and this is the mole fraction fraction of 
benzene c6 s6 you can see how i calculated mole fraction of benzene by applying mole fraction formula in case if you have to calculate mole fraction of carbon tetrachloride that is a solvent then you will put your solvent and rest of formula will be same thank you if you like this video please click the like button if you have any questions or suggestions please comment below for more updates on iit je or need exams please subscribe to our channel to get lot of updates support us by following us on facebook and twitter to sharpen your skills please try out our test series on livetotalage.com thank you so much for watching have a great day